It's the hard in Germany. What's up, cereal heads? Today we're going to talk about two German cereals, strawberry minis and cookie crisp chakella toasts. I've gotten to know a lot of international cereal heads through this Cereal Time channel, and from time to time, some of them offer to send me some cereals that we don't have here in America. One of those super generous Cereal Time fans is a cereal head named Stefan who lives over in Germany. Stefan also has a wonderful blog about cereal, which I'll leave a link to down in the description but it's in German, so make sure you have Google Translate, or if you're lazy, you can just look at the pictures. But you should definitely check it out. Anyway, Stefan was kind enough to send me some German cereals a while back, and I'm only just now getting around to checking them out. Let's start with strawberry minis. Okay, so right off the bat, you can see this looks like a box of Cinnamon Toast Crunch. It has the crazy square guy on the front here, and he's covered in a swirl of strawberry goodness. It also appears like he has a coating of cinnamon sugar on him, but I don't think that's actually the case. We'll find out in a minute when I open this sucker up. So in Europe, the Cinnamon Toast Crunch brand is produced by Nestle, as you can see here. It says 33% whole grain up there, and then Erdbeer, which means strawberry, and then Mit Erdbeer Gerschmack, which means with strawberry flavor. No, I don't speak German, as you can tell by that horrible pronunciation. I just use Google Translate. Now the back of the box is pretty underwhelming. It says crazy strawberry flavor here, and then shows these rabid strawberry mini pieces about to tack each other in this bowl of milk. And you can see the other mini boxes here, one is golden and one is cinnamon. The fact that there is one cinnamon one makes me sure this one doesn't have cinnamon flavor in it. But let's open it up and take a look. So here's what a bowl of this strawberry mini cereal looks like. You can see the red swirls on the pieces that are the same pieces they use in Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And then there's the dusting of sugar covering each piece. It's got a nice strawberry smell to it. Let's hit it with some milk. Mmm, this stuff is good. Now, I'm probably biased because I love fruit flavored cereals, especially strawberry, but the flavor is spot on. The strawberry flavor is not too strong. It actually tastes pretty much like strawberry toast crunch, just not as sweet. The only thing that's a little disappointing to me is that it's not a strawberry cinnamon toast crunch flavored cereal. I wish they would have added just a faint strawberry flavor to the cinnamon toast crunch pieces. That would have been an awesome cereal. But hey, I can always mix the two cereals together and make that awesome flavor combination myself. Mm. Now that is a magically amazing, delicious cereal flavor combination. Cereal makers out there, take note. Cinnamon sugar and strawberry. Combine those flavors and you'll have a cereal hit. All right, let's check out this second cereal from Germany. This one's called Cookie Crisp Chokella Toasts. Now a few things. First, you'll see Chip the Wolf as the mascot here on the front. Now he's been the Cookie Crisp mascot since about 2005, but he actually first started appearing on boxes over in Europe a few years before they brought him stateside to replace Chip the Dog. Second, you can see from looking at the pieces on the box here, this isn't really a Cookie Crisp cereal. Now, maybe it's getting lost in translation, but those pieces aren't cookies at all. In fact, they're little tiny toasts, which to me makes this one fall under the Toast Crunch family we have here in the US. Now we have French Toast, Blueberry Toast, Strawberry Toast, and Apple Cinnamon Toast Crunch, which all have little tiny toast pieces in them. Now since Nestle seems to produce both Cookie Crisp and Cinnamon Toast Crunch in Europe, I guess they just kind of cross-pollinate the brands and use whatever cereal shapes they want. But the normal chocolate chip flavor Cookie Crisp in Europe looks the same as ours. It looks kind of better than ours, actually. Look at that bowl. Okay, last thing here from the front of this box, Chokella. Now that's a chocolate hazelnut spread made by Nestle. So basically, it's what we know as Nutella. It's just a different brand of the delicious chocolate hazelnut spread. So unless I'm mistaken, this is the first Nutella flavored cereal out there. At least the first one I've ever tried. All right, let's take a look at the back of the box here. This here roughly translates to solve the puzzle before Chip gets the cookie crisp. You can see him reaching for it. This first puzzle asks you to solve the word salad here. It says cookie crisp when you unscramble it. This second puzzle asks which scooters are different than the rest. This was a little more difficult, but it's the pink one since the flag is on the wrong side there. And lastly, it asks you to figure out which path leads to the tunnel. That's an easy one. It's B. Okay, time to open this sucker up and take a look. So here's what a bowl of cookie crisp chokella toast looks like. You can see the little mini toast pieces are just like our toast crunch pieces here in the US. They have a nice chocolate hazelnut brown color to them and a little dusting of sugar there. Mmm, this stuff definitely smells like Nutella. It's not too strong of a scent, but I'm excited to try it. Let's add some milk. Wow, that's a pretty awesome rich flavor. You can definitely taste the Nutella, or Chocella, sorry. But yeah, it's pretty great. If you're a fan of Nutella, you'll love this stuff. And who wouldn't love some delicious Nutella flavored milk? I don't know why we don't have this stuff here in the US. Nutella is insanely popular and people would eat this stuff up. 
literally. Maybe General Mills is just taking their time bringing it to the US market, or maybe they're trying to negotiate a deal with the Nutella company. Who knows? At least I have a pipeline to the German cereal market for whenever I'm fiending for some Nutella cereal. Man. They really need to make this cereal in the US. All right, well, that's gonna do it for these German cereals. Thanks again to my friend Stefan for hooking me up with these delicious German treats. I love finding out about international cereals that we don't have here in the US. As always, thanks for watching, and thanks to everyone from all the different countries who watch and support Cereal Time. I really, really appreciate it. Until next time, stay crunchy, or in German is it, blieb Nussberg. <laughs>